As I look back at Charutar Arogya Mandal's journey, I often ask myself, how did we really manage through the many challenges and yet emerge as one of the rare institutions that still truly represents the profession of medicine? I think of the countless young and promising lives that have been saved. The innumerable families that have managed to keep their spirits alive. And those suffering who have been without exception given solace. And ask myself, could we have done any of these without the unwavering support we have received from our donors? In a sense, that is what has defined the mandal. My father called it a venture of faith, and indeed, that is what it is. Every brick of every building on the Mandal's 100-acre campus has been laid with someone's contribution. It is only with the community's support that the Mandal has been able to set up and constantly upgrade its 600-bed Sri Krishna Hospital that is recognized as one of the most preferred healthcare destinations in Gujarat that treats over 400,000 outpatients and around 35,000 indoor patients every year. It is through their support that the Mandal's educational institutions also nurture over a thousand students every year and it is their generosity that has made it possible for us to offer a number of welfare measures for poor patients. Treatment to women and children from families whose income is less than 10,000 rupees a month is totally free and offered at 60% concession to men. Outpatient registration and consultation as well as bed, diet, nursing and consultation charges in general wards are free. We have been overwhelmed with your warmth and encouragement. You have helped us remain resolute in our efforts to continue being an example of the profession of medicine even though most hospitals have chosen to become a business today. Of course, there are many challenges the hospital's welfare programs cost the mandal over 12 crore rupees annually, that is over 1.25 million pounds or about 1.75 million dollars and increasing each year. The hospital needs to acquire newer equipment and facilities to ensure its mission of providing the same level of care to rural communities as are available to their urban counterparts. Equally important is the need to build on the foundation of quality medical education that the Mandal's educational institutions have laid. The medical college, which graduates a hundred students every year, is today recognized as one of the premier medical colleges in Gujarat, if not India. The students are sensitized to the challenges faced by the rural community from the very first year. Its graduates command a premium when they go out and seek placements. To contribute to meeting India's acute needs for competent doctors in larger numbers, we are now adding another 50 seats to the medical college. The increase in medical seats requires additional facilities both in the college and the hospital. An assessment centre has already been constructed. A library, we call it the knowledge centre, is under construction. We have also begun work on a new 160-bed hospital wing and a larger diagnostic centre for its labs. With the growing need for critical care, a facility with 100 critical care beds is being planned. While we engage ourselves fully and continuously in bringing about self-sufficiency, we would continue to need your support. I therefore appeal to you to partner us in our journey. A journey that brings hope 
and solace to those who do not have the means to benefit from the advances of medicine. Like the little Janvi, who suffered from a hole in the heart, and her parents came to the Sri Krishna hospital in despair, only to go back with a healthy baby and dreams for her. A journey that helps produce some of the most well-grounded and competent medical professionals. And it is a journey that would fill you with joy as well. The joy of being blessed by all those whose lives you have helped save. Those whose pain you have helped soothe. The joy of having helped creating a world-class medical institution that is a true example of what medicine should always be, noble and caring. I look forward to your support. Thank you.